And first, a Norfolk woman is fighting for her life after an early morning shooting. Police tell us the shooting happened around 3 this morning in the Mariner's Watch apartment complex in Ocean View. The victim is 33 years old. Ten on your side's Liz Palco spoke to the last person to see the victim right before the shooting. Liz? DNI spoke with the victim's friend as she got back from the police department after hours of interviews. She said she has no idea why someone would target her friend, but she does think she saw someone running from the scene. I'm as baffled as you standing in front of me. I have no idea why would someone do this. Suzanne Hing is trying to wrap her head around the violence that happened right outside her door early Sunday morning. Violence that has left her friend with multiple gunshot wounds. I pray for her and I pray for that person too because um, it's just senseless. Sunday afternoon, children play in a grassy area of the Mariner's Watch apartment complex in Ocean View. As Norfolk detectives canvass the area, a vehicle with three bullet holes and a flat tire is parked on Mariner's Way. It's this block that was a crime scene hours before. Hing said she and the victim returned around 3 a.m. after a night out. They had driven together. I watched her walk over to her car, start, and pull off. That's when I went back into my house. Moments later, she tells us she heard five shots fired by two more. It was then she saw the silhouette of a person run past her living room window in the direction of the wood line. I grabbed my phone to call her to ask her if she heard the shots. I called her three times. She didn't answer the phone. It wasn't until after about three or four minutes is when she called me and told me that she couldn't breathe. And that's when I realized that she had stopped right there. The police had already started pulling her out and telling me that I couldn't go near her. Police only confirmed the victim is 33 years old. Hing says her friend was shot in the leg and abdomen. She said she has lost a lot of blood and has already been in surgery, adding she has a long road in front of her. Her husband and her children are by her bedside right now. Um, that's where I'm going now. Police have not released any suspect information. They also haven't said if that person Hing saw running is a person of interest. Give police a call if you know anything about this shooting. I'm Liz Palka, 10 on your side.